guys, so today we're going to reflap your wings and we have a company here. It's Rosie. So we're going to say hi, Rosie, to the subscribers. Ah, hello. So, so this, this one is called Flap Your Wings by PDS. down the path. He saw an egg, the egg. He looked around. He saw flamingos and frogs and turtles and alligators. Whose egg is this? He called but nobody answered. So then the boy looked up. He saw an empty tree. Here's an egg without a nest, he said. Here's an egg without a nest, he said. And there's a nest without an egg. Then the boy climbed a tree and he put it in the nest. Then he went away. Mr. and Mrs. Bird came home. They were surprised to find an egg in your nest. That's not our egg, says Mrs. Bird. Look how big it is. But it is an egg. It's in our nest, says Mr. Bird. If an egg is in your nest, you sit on it and keep it warm. It doesn't matter whose egg is this. All right, said Mrs. Bird. I wonder what kind of bird will come out of this egg. Can you see the egg? Really big. They took turns keeping the egg warm. First, Mrs. Bird sat on it. Then Mr. Bird sat on it. And because, and because sometimes it was so big, they both sat on it. One day, Mrs. Bird hear a squeak noise. Help, she said. This egg is squeaking. Squeak, squeak, squeak. Mr. Bird came back to the nest. He listened to the egg. The egg was not squeaking, he said. It's our baby that's squeaking. He is ready to come out of the egg. Mr. Mr. and Mrs. Bird waited. Squeak, squeak, squeak. started to crack. Squeak, 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 squeak. Then it cracked some more. Squeak, 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 scratch, crackle. And there was the baby. Mr. Bird was excited. He was very excited. It's Junior, he shouted. What a beautiful baby. Can you see it at this? This is not a bird. You know that. Opened his mouth. It was a big mouth. It was full of teeth. And that funniest looking baby that I ever saw, said Mrs. Bird. Something was wrong. I don't think he's our baby at all. He is in our nest, so he is being ours, said Mr. Bird. He opened his, his mouth is open. That means he is hungry. When your baby is hungry, you feed him. Mr. and Mrs. Bird went away to get some food for Junior. Mr. Bird brought a big worm. Mrs. Bird 
got a got a green one. Junior and both ones he in one gulp. Then he opened his mouth again. Why again? We have to get Junior lots more to eat than Mr. and Mrs. Bird. Hour after hour, day after day, they brought food for Junior. Mrs. Bird got berries and cherries. She got butterflies and caterpillars. She got dragonflies and mosquitoes. She got ladybugs and tundra beetles. <laughs> Mr. Bird got crickets and spiders. She got grasshoppers and snails. She, he got red ants. He got black ants. He got crack tips too. They get a lot of food, but Junior is still hungry. What kind of bird eats so much? Said Mrs. Bird. He doesn't mat. It doesn't matter, said Mr. Bird. He is still hungry, and you have to feed it. Weeks went by. Junior never stopped eating, and he never. Stop growing. He grew bigger and bigger and bigger. Finally, Junior got so big that Mr. Bird said, It's too crowded up here. Junior has to leave the nest. It is time for him to fly away. You're right, said Mrs. Bird. The time has come. We, sh we must show him how to fly. See, guys, Junior is bigger than the tree and the nest. Mrs. Bird push and push. Mr. Bird showed Junior how to fly. Jump into the air like this, he said. Then flap your wings. Junior got ready. He took a deep, he took a big breath and jumped up, 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 went into the air. He went. Guys, do you think Junior can fly? Flap your wings, yelled Mrs. Bird. Flap your wings, yelled Mr. Bird. Junior flapped and flapped, but he did not do any good. He didn't have any wings. Down, 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 down went Junior. Down into the water. Splash! Can you see that? Junior went splash into the water, and then his tail is is on top of the water, and then he go deep into the water. It was cold and wet for Junior. It was right. It was just right for Junior. You know, said Mrs. Bird. I don't think Junior was a bird at all. It doesn't matter, said Mr. Bird. Now he's happy now, and just look at his swim. The end. So guys, do you think the crocodile was the baby of Mrs. and Mr. Bird's baby? I hope you enjoyed the story. Please subscribe to my videos and click the like and share. Goodbye.